Sharina here and welcome back to my channel. So today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you guys a little bit of a lifestyle haul, which will include some lifestyle pieces as well as some cosplay and beauty items as well. But before we get started, make sure to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already and hit that bell icon as well so you get notified when my new videos come out. I am trying to film a little bit more often, um, so hopefully I'll have my weekly routine back in play again soon. Um, but yeah, you'd wanna keep up with me on the daily. I am on Instagram. That's where I pretty much share my day-to-day -day things, um, especially my garden. Sydney went into its second lockdown. I think it's the like second one. Um, yeah, so lockdown 2.0. Um, I've been really into gardening and I bought like a lot of seeds, uh, like vegetable seeds, herb seeds, and uh, a few flower seeds. If you wanna see more about how my garden is going and how my little seedlings are going, definitely follow me on my Instagram. I share my Insta story on my garden like almost every day, so feel free to follow me there. But I also do like little daily updates as well, like what I eat, uh, what my mom and I are making or baking. So follow me on Instagram, that's where I'm more active. I will link it in the description box below for you guys. So yeah, let's get started. Um, there are quite a few things I wanna share with you guys, which I bought just before the lockdown happened and also during lockdown itself. So the first item I wanna share with you guys is this one here. It is a huge instant noodle bowl and it also comes with a lid. Um, I got this from YesStyle and it's very, very handy when I'm eating like instant ramen or when my mom makes it for me. She'll usually put it in this bowl because it's really easy to hold with the handle on the side and it also comes with a lid so if like I'm just in the shower um, as she's finishing up she can pop the lid on to keep my food still warm. Um, it is quite big as well. It also comes in a blue color but I really like the original red one so got this one. The next item I want to show you guys that I pretty much use almost every day or every second day is my massage gun. Um, so I bought this massage gun from Kmart. Uh, it was really surprising that they had a massage gun available. It wasn't too expensive. I think it's about 80 Australian dollars. So yeah, bought this one. It comes with different heads. I think three other different heads and it works really, really well. Like my mom is in love with the massage gun because she had a really tight lower back and she was asking me, hey, can you like use the massage gun on my back? And after using it, she's like literally in love with it. She can't live without it. She's always asking me to help her uh, massage her back for her because she can't reach in that area. This lifestyle item is one of my favorites because it's just super handy to um, get a quick massage in to really ease up my muscles and give it a good massage, especially around my shoulder and neck um, area. That's where it gets really tight for me because I work from a laptop and posture and looking down and everything so it's like mm, not the best um but yeah highly recommend you guys getting one if you haven't already i know there's quite a few different varieties on um, amazon and ebay as well so yeah otherwise if you have a kmart nearby definitely check and see if they have one because it's not that expensive and it works pretty well the next item, it hasn't been delivered yet and it's on its way, but I purchased some new bed sheets because most of my bed sheets are like getting really old. I've had them since I was really young. So it's time to get them replaced because some of them are ripping, some of them are really fading away and I decided to get some different colors. Um, so this is just a sample of the company that I purchased from and all the colors that they offer. I decided to go with a mustard yellow color here. Uh, one reason is because I wanted to welcome the spring and summer season with a really bright, happy color. And also this year, the year of the ox, apparently my lucky color is yellow. So another reason why I bought that one. I also purchased an olive color, which the sample is not available on this one just yet because it is a new color. So it's a really nice, deep olive green color. Um, I've never had green bed sheets before, but you know, I really like the look of an earthy green color, so I purchased that. I also got some hair accessories and some washi tape from Yasel as well. Um, so, starting off with the hair clips, I purchased three different hair clips. So, one of them I'm wearing today, and it's this beautiful 
um, rectangular oblong shape here and it's like a multicolored one and then I got this one in this marbleized emerald green in a teardrop shape and then I got this rainbow gummy bear one which is really really cute so yeah I also got the washi tapes from YesStyle as well so I bought a few different types of washi tape uh, this one's quite large as you can see compared to these ones here um, they are much thinner about one centimeter in width um, this one is a magical girl theme so you'll see like Elsa, Katkat Sakura, Sailor Moon I would usually cut around the character and then stick it onto my schedule diary and then um, these ones here so they are the like original size washi tapes or the one centimeter one, the one centimeter width I got these two here which are a bread themed one and then I got this one which is a Shiba Inu with its butt poking up uh, so that one's really cute and then this one is a maple leaf um, with rabbits all over it um, and then I also got some stickers as well so I got one that is uh, coffee themed and then one which are Japanese food puns so this one's actually quite entertaining for anyone who can read Japanese I recommend getting this one I bought these washi tape and stickers is because I like to decorate my schedule diary a little bit more I'm not the most um, creative person when it comes to drawing so I thought you know stickers would be a great way of just making it a little bit more colorful and unique to me so yeah now moving on to skincare, I recently shared a blog post about a brand that I've currently been using and have been loving. Um, it is the Haru Haru Wonder Black Rice Collection, so it's these ones here. Um, so I have the toner, the serum and the cream. The packaging for the serum and the toner is quite your average sort of packaging, but the cream one is a little bit more unique, shaped in an oval. Personally, I find it a little bit difficult to get the product out, especially if you're like at the last squeeze. I can imagine like just trying to squeeze every last product. It is a squeezy bottle, so you probably won't be able to get every last drop in there. Um, but we'll make do anyway. I also received these two bonus products when I was checking out of my YesStyle order. Um, the first one is a Say Clean Oil. So this one, um, I haven't had the chance to use it for a really long time, but it's actually very lightweight and apparently it's to help to um, firm the skin and also give it an instant hydration as well. Um, so I've yet to really um, use this a lot more. I'll probably review it in a couple months time after I've given it um, a chance. The other product I got is a mist. Um, so this one is just a treatment or a mist and I haven't had the chance to try it out just yet but I'm looking forward to using this. I absolutely love using like treatment mist or just mist in general throughout the day because it just helps hydrate the skin a little bit more and just freshens you up when you just need it. Um, so yeah, looking forward to using these two products and give a review on it on my blog a little bit later down the line. Um, I also received um, a nail polish kit and this is a gel nail polish kit by Madame Glam New York. Um, so I was actually gifted this one and I have tried using it out. It comes with a UV LED lamp and it's really handy because it's a mini size meaning you can take it anywhere with you. Um, all you need to do is just plug it in a USB cable, um, pull the legs out like so and then connect it to a power source and you just hit the button once for it to light up for 45 seconds, hit it twice, and at 60 seconds, hit it for the third time, it turns off. Um, but it's really, really handy, and I got three different colors. Um, so I let my mom and my little brother's girlfriend pick a color each. So I picked this one called November Stone, which I currently have on my fingers today. My mom chose the color Basil, which we actually did her nails earlier today. And then my little brother's girlfriend got Toffee Break. Um, she's yet to try it, so yeah. So far I can say I really, really like the product itself. Um, not just because I received it um, as a PR, but um, after trying it and using it, it's actually just really, really handy. I am terrible at waiting for my nails to 
dry with normal nail polish, I'm very impatient and I tend to knock my hands against things. So this actually sped up the process from like a 45, like half an hour to 45 minute like waiting period of my usual nail polish routine. This one just speeds it all up under 10 minutes for me. So really handy, really love it. Um, it also comes with like a base and top coat polish as well so it's all pretty much packed and ready to go so far i can say i really love the product i love their nail polish and their colors they are absolutely so beautiful super handy and it just makes painting my own nails that much easier i would definitely recommend it to anyone who hates waiting for their nails to dry with normal nail polish and get this little kit here moving on to some fashion pieces i guess you can say or clothing items um, the first one I want to share with you guys is this bag here, which my mom bought for me uh, via Taobao. Um, for those who don't know what Taobao is, it's basically a Chinese version of eBay, but they sell a lot of stuff, like a lot, lot more stuff. Um, it can be like handmade things to um, fully big manufacturing local shops in China. Um, but yeah, this one here is a beautiful rectangular bag. It also comes with the chain strap in here, but I'm not going to put it on because it's going to put it back in the dust bag. I have nowhere to go because of lockdown. Um, but yeah, my mom chose this beautiful lilac color because it is a trending color in um, the fashion world in China and she was like, oh, it looks so beautiful. I want to grab one. So she got this one for me now moving on to my cosplay items I did purchase a few cosplays recently and um, I haven't had the chance to wear them out to like a convention or anything just because of the second lockdown in Sydney um, We're not allowed to go out anymore and most of the conventions have been cancelled and postponed to a later time Most of them to early next year so I have to wait till then But let me share with you guys what I did get I'm gonna take them out of the bag because it's just gonna be a lot of trouble for me to put them back in But the first one I want to share with you guys is this one here which is my Hatsune Miku bun white bunny girl outfit um, and her wig so I've already styled the wig and I've already tried out this costume and it's super super cute um, I originally ordered this costume to do a shoot during Easter but then it, the delivery got delayed um, and so it didn't arrive until I think about May but I will probably plan a shoot with my friend at a later time anyway because I have some new costumes out and I want to shoot with them as well, so yeah. The other cosplay that I got with the White Bunny Miku one is the Shu Ten Doji um, maid outfit. So this one is quite sexy as well, but I really, really love um, Shu Ten Doji, the character from FGO. And yeah, I, I just can't wait to do more cosplays of her. I've done her um, zombie cosplay. So if you haven't seen those pictures on my Instagram, they're up on my Instagram, but yeah, I really want to do her maid outfit as well. So the next costumes um, recently just came in with my mom's latest help out order. Uh, so starting off with is this one here. Um, so this one is my Evangelion Asuka plug suit, which is I think is her second plug suit or the new era plug suit one. Um, I did try it on earlier this morning and it is a pretty well fitted costume except the fact that if you lift your arms up that's probably where you'll get a little bit of a wedgie so I would probably size it up and then like sew it down like to slim it if you need to um, just so that your crotch and your butt can have a little bit more freedom when it comes to your movements um, thankfully with the character Oscar I don't think there's a lot of times where she needs to put her hands up real high, so thank god. <laughs> uh, so thank goodness for that, um, posing for this character would be a little bit easier. The last costume that I did get is also for um, the character Asuka from Evangelion. And this one is um, one of the latest costumes that um, I've seen for her character and it's like her in this more casual skirt dress outfit. Um, so it's that one there. And I have yet to wear it, but I can see these holographic panels here and it looks really, really pretty. So I think it's a pretty well made costume and I can't wait to try it out. So yeah. And the last item I want to share with you guys, it's not really a costume, but um, it is this um, 
an outer howdy sort of thing, like a kind of a cardigan, I guess you can say, but it's um, more of a kimono sleeve style one. And if I take it out of the bag, this one I don't mind taking out of the bag because it'd be easy to pull back in. This is what it looks like here. So it's got like the kimono, um, the short howdy sleeves. Um, or kimono sleeves, and then the design on the back is da -da -da -da. Zenitsu. Um, so the design on the back is Zenitsu. Um, I really liked how it's a very simplistic design, um, bringing out a bit of anime ness to it. So, yeah, um, decided to buy it because Zenitsu from Demon Slayer is one of my favorite characters. I know a lot of my friends tell me that. He is just so, so annoying because he's always complaining and everything, but I, I don't know, I just really like his character. I guess it's, it's, yeah. <laughs> so that brings us to the end of the video and I hope you guys enjoyed my little haul on my lifestyle beauty and cosplay items that I got recently. Um, of course, if you guys want to see a video dedicated to one specific category, do let me know in the comment box below so I can fulfill those video requests. And just a little update on my channel, I am going through a revamping phase, um, just trying to change it up a little bit to see what I want to do with it or what content I really want to share with you guys. So if there's any specific content um, that you really want to see more of, do let me know in the comment box below. And I also know some of you want to see more like Hanfu or um, cultural related sort of uh, videos as well, so I'll see what I can do. I'm also going to be using the community tab on my YouTube channel a little bit more just to get engaged with you guys and see what you guys are doing as well and what you guys think um, on different like topics of, of polls and whatnot. So yeah, before I end this video, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit that like button as well. And if you want to catch up with me on a more daily basis and what I get up to, Follow me on my Instagram because that is where I pretty much go every day. You'll definitely see a lot of my gardening updates, so check it out there. Anyways, thank you guys for watching this video and I can't wait to see you guys in the next one. Bye!